Welcome back everyone to the next episode of Dragon Ball X Universe 2 with the DLCs. Gonna be finishing up DLC 1 hopefully. Hopefully this will be the last episode. I think we got pretty far into it, but we should be finishing up, I think, relatively soon. Best of luck out there. Let's see if we can finish up this bad boy. Kind of like halfway through the tournament. So hopefully we can finish that tournament up and finally be done with it. Striving for perfection. Got my boy hit. Oh my gosh. It totally did not let me know when it was out of a cutscene. So I'm really curious because I haven't been watching the American version of Super just yet. I've watched a couple of episodes, but really I'm like super behind actually. Like I haven't caught up since I think episode 3 or 4. I'm not super far into it. But I'm not sure as of like when I'm recording this if they've actually gotten to this arc yet for Dragon Ball Super and the English dub because I know all these voices. Um, I mean, we constantly hear them in the game, but I'm curious as to whether or not they've actually stuck with the same people and everything. Because I know that Super, um, or, uh, in Super, Black Goku's voice was changed. He didn't keep it. He stuck with a different guy, or not a different guy, but the person who does um, Black Goku's voice, or just Goku's voice in general, is Sean Schimmel, and... I know that he changed the Black Goku voice. It used to be, I don't know, it's kind of hard to explain. It used to be a really raspy, but he kind of changed it to be more Frieza-like. You guys actually can see that change of when he does the voice in person versus when he does the voice like in this. It's a little bit different. So I wonder how much they've tweaked the voices. I'm sure Hit and everyone else is kind of the same, but... I definitely know they changed a few. Do I have to fight? I have to fight three people right now? This is definitely not fair. Can I not do this right now with three people? Three versus one? Yeah, Monica. At least Goku, for the love of Christ. Goku, at least. I need some help. Frost seems to be pretty easy. Kaba, on the other hand, tends to be kind of difficult. Don't know what it is. At least with the last fight, I always felt like Kaba did a little bit worse. Maybe it was his stamina. He might have just had low stamina, so it's a lot easier to fight him. I don't actually remember. To use a capsule. Really, dude? Really? Finish off one dude at a time. It's the best option. Get wrecked. And I kind of want to talk about my channel today, guys, because I've been getting on a kind of a pattern. I don't know if you guys have actually noticed it. Comment down below if you've actually noticed the, uh, at least like kind of the pattern I have. He's not taking damage right now. This is stupid. But I kind of, you know, every single Friday I have my TP Metal Shop update and then sometime within the week, the beginning of the week, I always have my yeah, Dragon Ball video, which I'll move on to a new game after I finish Dragon Ball because I have like just DLC left. That or I'll switch to like a new character or something like that. I might do that instead. Depends what you guys want. Let me know what you guys want. Do you want me to start a new character or should I try and... Uh, Maybe pick up a new game or something. I'm gonna play Fighter Z when it comes out for the PS4 and kind of play that and see how that goes. But I know what you guys think. But the pattern I've been uploading just like that every Friday TP Metal Shop update, and then beginning of the week I always have my like Dragon Ball X Universe playthrough video. That's how I've been sticking with this. So you at least get two videos every week. But I'm integrating another video now. 
It'll either come out every weekend or it'll come out during the week. Oh my. Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Kyle Ken. It's insane. That's so sick. I love that he does that. Can Frost take damage? He can. Let's finish Frost off. I'm tired of him. But I'm going to be doing a new video, guys. It'll either come out on the weekends, if I can make it fast enough. Because I start production on it on weekends and writing it and everything. And then it'll come out either that weekend. But if the week starts, that means I have to record this video and get this video out. So that means it will delay the bigger project video to have to come out midway or later within the week and this week happens to be that this got in the way so I have to have it come out later but basically I've been just going to like old game franchises or new game franchises and been kind of like discovering a game like games that we thought were gonna come out but they never did or what games are coming out that we predict are gonna come out very soon or we thought were supposed to come out already and they never did and the first one I did was on Bethesda. That did fairly well, and I'm, I got a really good response from that. And I think I got a lot of new subscribers as well. So thank you if you did subscribe to that video and you're watching this. That's really awesome. I'm glad that I was able to branch out a little bit, find some new people for my channel. But, um, the one I'm working on right now is Sucker Punch. Big game franchise that I've always loved. Always loved Sucker Punch since I was a little kid. The game franchise, anyway. I'm gonna find out what they've been doing. I've been digging up a lot of research, editing this video, and I'll have it come out probably within another day or two. Like I said, if it doesn't come out on the weekend, it's gonna come out later that week, so it'll probably be a little bit. There's Frost. Jeez, Frost took two healing items. Two healing items, and I thought he was the easier one. I might be mistaken here. Kaba's got so much stamina. But he's an idiot. <laughs> he's a complete idiot. Oh, what's the fighting pose there? Dude, Kaba, chill. This brings up my stamina. Right? Yes, it brings up stamina regeneration. So my stamina regenerates just a little bit faster. I don't really care about Goku. Goku can get slapped up all he needs to. As long as I'm safe. <laughs> oh, I could have went golden this whole time. What am I doing? Sometimes I forget. Because it doesn't do a whole lot for me. Like, it kind of turns my aura golden and some other parts of me golden. But it doesn't do a whole lot, honestly. So, it's kind of hard for me to notice it, honestly. Now I'm getting hit by hit. That's a weird way to say that. So I'll have a new video coming out here soon about another like game franchise. I'm really excited about these videos. They're really fun to make. I actually put a lot of production into it. Which makes it really fun. The fact that I can put a lot of production into it means I have to. I feel like I need to do it. Especially over how well the first one went down. It's even more so that I have to... Uh, make it a good video again and have something to kind of show up from my last video show that I can do better and I can do other videos like it too Cobb has no stamina, hit him, hit him wait what? no way, I totally punched him before he had the chance to do that he is, he's got no health left he still has no stamina Bro, are you kidding me? How's he teleporting around with no stamina? Boy. Boy. I like how I, I say stamina every single video and blame it all on that. But it's so hard not to notice it when literally the whole game is just based on it. Okay, I'm rather throw him some supernovas. Hopefully if Goku dies it doesn't matter. That would really, really suck if it did. See if we can hit him again. Or actually hit him, I mean. 
What? How close do I have to be for this thing, dude? I'm literally, like, not that far away. The stage isn't that long. There we go. I think it's Goku's fault. Goku's hitting him away. Alright, we're gonna throw one more at him. Goku's about to die. That did nothing. Alright, fighting pose. Let's get my stand up a bit. Alright, let him and Goku fight a little bit. See if we can keep Goku alive. Goku's about to die, so let's see if we can keep him on the ropes. Keep him on the ropes long enough to just win. Well, Goku's actually been helping. Not killing them, but he's keeping them distracted, so he's not fighting me the whole time. Which I like that. I don't mind that one bit. The Key Blast is so much better in golden form than in normal form. Normal form is so bad. Clear. That's it. Good. Keep concentrating on your training. It's a level up. I'll take it. Not bad. That could be it for the tournament. Actually, on a mission. I love Champa's voice. I think they did such a great job with him. Animation is so good. So is that it? Pretty scary, aren't they? Blah, blah, blah. Maybe we hold a what a turn of our own and bring fighters from all over. That's kind of what happens. Just my imagination. 
Nah, I think you're just whack trunks. I don't know what you're on about. Okay, it looks like it's the end. Yep. That is the end of DLC 1, guys. If you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe. You can expect more content here soon. I'll have my special edited video, my produced video that's actually really good, come out here in a couple days. And then you can always expect your TP Metal Shop Friday episode every Friday, of course. I'll see you all in the next video. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.